Hi everyone. How are you doing today? Hope you have a wonderful day. Today I'm going to show you how to make a h e a steak tuna with truffle oil, and I'm gonna cook them on cast iron. Hopefully, this delicious dish will bring to you and your family a great dinner. Let's get ready to cook. Are you ready? Let Do it. First of all, I have a h e a steak tuna. It's piece around six ounce. Look at how the beautiful red color. With cauliflower and green bean. I love everything but bagel. Sesame seasoning on it, and here is some truffle oil collection. Let's see which one is the lucky oil for me to use on my tuna today. I have one tablespoon of black sesame seed. One teaspoon of black pepper, and half teaspoon of pink Himalayan salt, and some unsalted butter. Let me prepare for tuna. Make sure you use the paper towel to dry the tuna up, because when you shear the tuna, if they have a lot of water on it. Then they're going to be flush the butter everywhere, and you don't want your tuna dancing with the butter. Trust me. Let's sprinkle some salt. I love h a m a l i a n pink salt. Some. Pepper, and then some sesame seed. Make sure you pat it out so they can stick into the tuna. When you cook, they c o n t they won't come off. Flip them over. And then we will do the same thing with some salt, some pepper, and some sesame seed. Look, already look delicious already. Let me prepare for the veggie. Let those guys ready to put in the oven. This is gonna be a healthy meal for everyone. I'm going to sprinkle some olive oil all over the veggie. Of course, I'm gonna put bagel sesame seasoning on it. Then I'm gonna put them in the oven with a little salt too, and then I'm gonna put them in the oven. Prepare your oven with three fifty. And you're gonna put them in there around 20 m i n u t e s First of all, I let them dance, dance, dance before they got into the oven. I'm get ready for my cast iron getting hot. I'm gonna put some butter in there. And you have to make sure it's getting super hot before you put the tuna in. You don't want to cook them in there while they still cold.
I think it's ready. Let's put them in. And I'm gonna cook each side like around three minutes. Make sure that you pass them down so they can cook evenly. I think it's ready. Let's turn it over. And it will be the same way. You cook like around between two and a half to three minutes each side, okay? Make sure you move the cast iron uh, up and down so we can get the butter go around the fish. I'm going to shear them around the tuna too. But pretty much the tuna have three sides and then we just turn them around it's side like around 30 seconds and then we just flip it around just like that make sure you check them if they still soft in the middle, it means they're medium rare. You don't want to be overcooked tuna. They won't be taste that good anymore if they're overcooked. So now the veggie is ready. Let's place it. And I'm going to sprinkle them with some white truffle oils on the tuna. Your delicious dinner is ready to eat. You can show them with some wine if you would like. Please don't forget to share and subscribe my YouTube channel. Hope this video is useful to you. And don't forget to check it out my next video. Have a wonderful day. Thank you everyone. See you in my next video.